everybody, the Billy and Donnie adventure continues hanging out from Venice in the Grand Canal here. Uh, just wanted to stop in and say hi. Hello. Uh, we've been here before, uh, but just wanted to go ahead and share with some of you, maybe who have never seen it before. Uh, Venice itself is actually an island, and you know, we found out that the locals, they, they really don't like it when you call it an island. Um, they prefer to refer to it as the historical district. So. Anyhow, uh, we'll pan around just a little bit, let you see a little here, and we'll take uh, a few more just short clips today. Um, you know, and when I get home, probably merge everything together and present one beautiful movie to everybody. What do you think? Sure. Anything you want to say? Yes, we just uh, been here five years now. We've been living in Bulgaria, and uh, we just uh, travel now for second time to Venice, Italy, and uh, we just love it here. Today were my parents for four days here in uh, this country and I just wish uh, you all a uh, very blessed day. Alright, love you all. Love you all. Yes, no. There you go, here's a quick panoramic of the uh, Grand Canal. You can see there's a lot of people here. Uh, actually, this is the off season. <laughs> And you can see how many people are here. You can see there's no cars here in Venice. Uh, nothing uh, motorized unless it can go in the water, which is pretty cool. Um, so you can walk the streets safely, not concerned about anything. Uh, you know, nobody's going to hit you with a car. You don't have to wait for a car to walk the street or anything like that. There we go, and there's Billy and her family, everybody. Billy doing what she likes best. of St. Marco, per, they call, I think they call it uh, San Marco Piazza. Okay. We're here at this church, San Marco's church here. Uh, they charge uh, three euro to get into this, which is roughly three dollars and some change, uh, or six leva. Um, uh, what is so unique about this church and why the line is so big is that many years ago, uh, the story goes, many years ago, Venice had uh, nothing to attract people. So they stole the body of who they call St. Mark, uh, which is uh, Mark that uh, wrote the Gospel of Mark. They stole the body, and he is buried inside this church. Uh, therefore, they now started to have uh, some type of attraction for people. 
But what is cool about this, uh, these structures here, and you look at them, it's that they put the heavy stuff on the top of the structures. They put the heavy materials on the top and down the bottom, like you, you can easily see it here, where all of your bricks and everything are up top. And down the bottom, it's all lightweight. That's just a, a little bit cool, a little bit different. So we're gonna go inside here. Don't know if I can take video in there or not, but we're gonna try. We're gonna go inside there and try, see what happens. So anyhow, have a great day, everybody. Coming in from the other direction of uh, San Marco Piazza. Yeah, this is obviously years ago the, where the uh, dignitaries coming in from the Aegean Sea. They would come in right here uh, and then come into this plaza right here. There you go, a little bit of outdoor European cafe here. They're all over the place here. You see, here we are from the other side of. That church called the Basilica San Marco. Uh, couldn't actually get in there. Uh, they said my backpack was too big. They wouldn't allow me in. So it is what it is. I'm not gonna fight them. It's their church, their rules. So.
Baptist Church. Yes, the Catholic Church on the right of the bridge is its name is Santa Maria di Nazareth. The Catholic Church a building on the 17th century and this moment is just being completely restored. The another church on the left, the biggest there, is named San Simeone, another Catholic Church building on the whole part of the 16th century. The many have a total about 118 Catholic churches in all cities. Hello everybody, the Billy and Donnie adventure is continuing, still hanging out in Venice, Italy. Venice, uh, Italy. We've decided to hop on board a gondola, uh, gondola. and uh, Mr. Igor is going to bring us around the Grand Canal and all of the little beautiful canals that are uh, that, that just flood this city, like literally. Um, so we'll go ahead and let you see a little bit of it around here. and. I'll let you say hello to Igor in just a moment as well, but we miss everybody, we love you all, and love we can't wait to take this trip with you! Woohoo! I'll take that, thank you. Here we are. Woohoo! We are going right down here. Uh, here is Mr. Igor. Ah, oh, there he is. Uh, here we are. And I'll let this video run for a little while and let you experience it with us. Let me show you who's here with me. We have uh, Vili right there, of course, and she's taking her own picture. Vili's parents, to say hello. 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 <laughs> Enjoying this is their first time in Venice, and you know it's so cool. You can't get the smile off of her face. Look at that, ah, uh, Vili's mother. So cool. Bravo, husband of the year, right there. Look at that. So, Grand Canal. Get that done. I'm gonna let this run for a few minutes, and then I will give you your kiss in Venice on the gondola, my love. It's a little tip, man. Sometimes it just takes a little bit of money to make them happy. <laughs> there we go. That's hello. Hello, America. <laughs> hey, this is all the kids on a field trip. Look at that. Look at that. Now, you know, I suppose if we had our own boat, we could stop everywhere here and get off and get a, you know, coffee or something. Like we just saw at that place there, there's little stairs that you can get up. And you can see coming up here on the right, there are some stairs. Hey. Oh, some stairs on the left, too. So you park your boat right here in Venice and, you know, this, since no cars allowed, if you can if you see that in any of the videos, there's no cars. All right, well, everybody, we miss you all. We love you all. And I'm going to enjoy the rest of this uh, gondola with my pretty bride. <laughs> 